I think a photograph have to, has to engage you emotionally in order to be a good photograph. It can be technically perfect, it can be interesting because of uh, the information it gives, but unless it engages you emotionally, it's, uh, it's just another picture. It's just another exposure. I think one of the things you learn about when you're photographing is when you have the picture or what is a good picture. Um, it, when I was a young student, sometimes I would see something which I thought was spectacular and I would shoot a whole roll of film on it. And I'd get back and look at the contact sheet and there was, I thought, wow, how could I have thought that was interesting? There's nothing there. And sometimes something which was so offhanded, maybe you shot one frame or two frames and you get back and think, oh, that was, that's an incredible situation. Why didn't I shoot more? It, that's really the, the big uh, challenge of photography, finding the right picture and then trying to uh, craft the picture out of a situation which sometimes is fluid and in motion and trying to, you know, grab that moment. For me, you know, especially when you're shooting for a blog, something that you have to put up every day, uh, a successful photograph is either something that creates some kind of emotion. Um, like I said, it could be a whole range of emotions, but it's also something I'd want to look back at, you know, two years from now or three years from now or hopefully 25 years from now. I, I think an iconic photograph is just simply one that's, we all know, it has meaning, it has it evokes some emotional response. And it's a picture that we go back to time and time again. A fine image, one that you would uh, congratulate, applaud, be moved by, is the image that leaves something behind, the image that transports us to a place that's truly meaningful and that we're, uh, and that we're glad to be in this, in this meaningful place. Uh, iconic images change us. Uh, iconic images are ones that somehow sear into our soul and, uh, and make a difference. I think sometimes it takes on a, uh, a life of its own, you know, and, you know, I think of Steve's work and obviously the Afghan girl is, you know, one of the most iconic images, but it's not one of my favorite of all of his work. I think it's a great, great image, but there are other ones I would probably turn to first that mean more to me. Well, the description of an iconic photograph is really quite simple. It's one that has lasted for a number of years and keeps on not getting old.